<laughs> yeah, we wrapped it like two weeks ago. It was mad. Oh my God, what an adventure. I have no idea. I never have any idea what any of this shit is gonna turn out to be that we, that we do over the years. You just keep your fingers crossed and do the best you can. I'd say I worked with an extraordinary crew who went through an awful time during the strike, you know? All the, the sound department, the catering department, the lighting department, the electric department, makeup, everyone had to stand down for the writers and the actors who did need to go on strike. And they were just, we, so we shot three months and then we broke for five or six during the strike and then we picked up for three and everyone just picked up exactly where we left off. It's dark, the Penguin is so dark. I'm so glad to be done with it. Um, and I loved it, but man, I was ready not to sit in the makeup chair anymore when we were finished. You know, I, I loved doing the character in the film, you know, and, and this really did get to look, as they say in America, under the hood. You know, in the film, he's all flash and pizzazz and he's a raconteur and he's a proprietor of the club. You don't really get to five or six scenes and I loved it, but this really got to look under the hood and get into his backstory. And it's his rise to, to some version of power that he's always dreamed of inhabiting, you know, violent as anything and so dark. We'll see. I hope it's, I hope it's good.